Okay, we're now going to compute the variance and standard deviation for a Poisson random variable. And for a Poisson random variable, the distribution is given by the probability that x is equal to a is lambda to the k, e to the minus lambda, all over k factorial. And these k values, they're representing the number of times something happens, so they're non-negative integers. Okay, so in a previous video, we saw that the expectation is our, our um, parameter lambda. Now, how can we compute the variance? Well, it's nothing new. It's the exact same calculation as what we've seen before. It's just the details will, um, will change a little bit. So it's the expectation of x minus mu squared, which means we find these values, multiply by the probabilities, and sum. So that's going to be the sum. Uh, possibilities go from 0 to infinity. So this will be the sum from 0 to infinity of k minus mu. Mu is the expectation, which in this case is lambda squared, times the probability that x is k. And actually, I'm not going to write that here. I'm going to go ahead and plug in my distribution formula, which is lambda to the k, e to the minus lambda, over k factorial. And again, this is very messy to evaluate by hand, so we are going to instead use Wolfram Alpha to do the hard work for us. Okay, so I'm going to sum k minus... Now, I don't have a lambda key on my keyboard. If I type L, that looks like too much like a 1 or an absolute value, so I'm not going to use L. Uh, let's see, I'll use Y. So Y is representing my lambda here. K minus lambda squared okay, times E to the power of minus lambda. Lambda to the K divided by K factorial, and we're summing from K equals 0 to infinity. Alright, and Wolfram Alpha is going to compute this for us, and it finds that we just get Y. Wow, that was simple. Um, so remember, Y stood for lambda, so our variance for a, for a Poisson random variable is just going to be lambda. Well, let's go back to the blackboard and write that down, and then make sure that we write down the standard deviation as well. So for a Poisson random variable, the variance is the same as the mean, right? Lambda, which is the parameter. And then the standard deviation is just the square root of lambda. Oops. Okay, so that is the variance and standard deviation for a Poisson random variable.